Um, today I want to talk about the the latest trend in uh, happen on the social internet. Yes, I'm trending. Facebook, I saw that people took the video, we posted on Facebook, others reposted on TikTok, others re they cannot repost on YouTube because of copyright issues. People have talked, people have said what they want to say, others have criticized me, others have insulted me. But uh, we are right, everyone is right, whatever you're saying is right, and my DM is blocked because uh, many people are coming to give me advice. Others still feel that uh, because I said I'm gay, I should not be gay. And others are coming to my DM. The reception hasn't been, been good for the people who have been into my DMs. And uh, I cannot criticize anyone because I'm the one who came public and said that uh, I'm gay. And I was seen with the most famous gay that you know. Sorry to say, but one of the most famous. And uh, I want to do this video for the first and last time. At least I want to, to change the story because right now i'm infamous i'm not famous i'm infamous most people know me and uh, even traveling has become so difficult for me because once you border matatu everybody's looking at you and wondering i saw this guy is trending and he's in matatu so i want to change that uh, mentality and uh, not to blame anyone but to blame myself but because you listen to me in that interview saying i'm gay i want also again to you to listen to me at this video saying about the truth that happened uh, okay uh, this is a screenshot of me talking to to jude and talking about the video and uh, to be honest i never knew that these things will turn the way they turned and uh, as you can see this screenshot here i was talking to jude about how we plan about the cloud chasing the first time we met actually on the video on the Nicholas Kierkegaard interview, I said that uh, the one who approached Jude, but uh, the fact is that, as you can see on the screenshot, he texted me the first time, and I replied, he got my number from TikTok, even on my TikTok bio, you can see my number, and even on my YouTube description, you can see my, my number as well. So, he texted me, he told me, how are you, I'm good, uh, blah, 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 so many things we talked, but um, I thought, I know Jude is gay, but I'm not gay. What can I? What can we help each other? Because I knew he was approaching me. Maybe nothing else, not business, nothing else. Maybe that I'm gay because of my peers. Um, I pierced my ears and so many things. So for me, I never, I never talk and read to anybody or any gay who comes to my DM because my image might speak and might uh, tell people that I'm gay. But uh, that's not the truth. I branded myself like this because I think this is how I look good according to me and I was a musician before I quitted because of many other stories and um, me and Jude, we met the first time on that interview with Nicholas Kiyoko. We met outside there, uh, we, we got an Uber, we went first of all where Jude stays. Uh, I won't say where he stays for security issues or maybe it's not good to disclose. We did that video on his YouTube channel about introducing the new boyfriend. We talked, actually, I wish I could even record some videos or audios behind the scenes us talking about how we are planning. I even scripted everything. This is the screenshot of me scripting everything. You can see even the date. Scripting everything on how we're supposed to be him posting pictures. That's why you've seen, I've never posted him on my wall anywhere, either YouTube, TikTok, or even Instagram. He kept on telling me that people are now telling him to, to you know, you never knew that I'm cloud chasing. He knew that you are going to be to start dating. That's the honest truth. I've told you that this is the, the last video that I'm doing. So, he told me that uh, we've gone cloud chase, maybe we can talk later and no. So, after the interview, he wanted to kiss me and I told him we will do it next time we're going to do an interview because we're planning to do another interview with this guy called President Ali. But uh, that day we're supposed to do too, but we got late on the first interview with Nicholas Kyoko. Nobody knew that we are cloud chasing. Nicholas knew it was true. Jude knew it was true. I'm the only person who knew that I'm cloud chasing. So after that video, we were supposed to go to and see Ali, but 
a list manager who was calling Jude, but we could not make it because of time. It was getting late, so I told Jude that I want to go home. We got an Uber. He dropped me at uh, near my place because I did not want to go to Jude's place again and come back because I knew maybe things could happen. And to me, I was not comfortable at all. And I never wanted her to, him to notice, but um, I want to spoil this thing. I'm cloud chasing maybe with her, with him because. He is famous. I wanted things to stay underground. So if you could go to his place, I could have refused because I have no gay feelings. I have nothing to do with gazing. But now the plan could be destroyed. So the first video that we did, we are planning actually to go for the second video with President Ali. But it would blow out, it would blow up that we needed not to do it. We needed not to do any other video because that had blown up and everybody was talking about me. I could go through the comments. I want to be honest, the first time I read the comments, I was getting really sick. Like, I never knew it could spread that way. Even the, the original video on the original YouTube channel, where he did the first interview, never blew up more than the other bloggers who took it. Every blogger in each and every county really posted that video. I don't know, actually, I never knew why this thing, that thing really goes viral. Even the most recent videos, on my YouTube channel, the one that I'm talking about, Jude, is the one that has done better than any other, other videos. Forget about the charity videos, forget about the game videos, forget about the prank videos. The one that is about gazing, that's the most viewed videos. Even when you see the click rate and impression rate, it's very high compared to other videos. To leave that alone, uh, I want to change the... I, I, I won't call it conspiracy, because I'm the person who went and said the same thing and I'm the person again who's supposed to say that that was a cloud chase. I'm not having a grudge with anybody. I'm not here to destroy or tarnish anybody's name. But I'm going, I'm, I'm here to save myself. I went through other comments and other people are saying, oh, you're too cute to be gay. Oh, you don't deserve. Um... I said it's okay. But inside me, I knew that I'm not gay. I'm cloud chasing. But, uh, one of my friends told me, even if you are cloud chasing, that was not the right way. Because taking yourself out of that hole you've dug yourself, it's kind of difficult. So you have to understand, you, it will take you a lot of time to get out of that. So I said, there's no problem. I'll talk. People will understand me. The few will understand me. Other few won't understand me. There's no problem. Especially those who are gay, they will say, oh no, you're gay, you have what? These are not gay, at least they understand me. They say, okay, this guy has no gay vibes. I say, no problem. So that was the video, please.